Due to his loyalty and political prowess, Van Buren was unanimously voted as the presidential candidate for the Democratic Party in 1836. Just as Van Buren had created the Democratic Party as a direct opposition to John Quincy Adams' presidency, a party called the Whig Party had been made to oppose Andrew Jackson. The Whig Party attempted to stop Van Buren from getting a majority by nominating three candidates from different regions. However, they underestimated Van Buren, who still won, receiving 50.8% of the popular vote. After the election, Van Buren became the first president who was a U.S. citizen from birth. 